Good morning. In the year of August 1999, I wrote a play and I called it Red December. And when my father was 13 years old, his father, Louis Rupert Erica, had died on December 27, 1941, while flying in a PBY Squadron 101, Wing 10, over the Hollow Islands on a bombing mission in the early beginning of World War II. I studied and found information and that is why I wrote my play for my father. During rehearsal, my mother Hilda sat and watched, and when it was over, I saw her crying, and she said to me that the play would affect the World War II generation. After the opening performance, Red December, he too, he started crying and I embraced him. And he was thinking about his father when he was only 13 years old while watching Red December of how his father died gloriously in the two weeks after Pearl Harbor in World War II. Act One, Scene Two. The lights slowly rise as third pilot Edgar Hazelton enters the hut. He is in his early twenties wearing his working blue bell bottoms and has a timid appearance. He is alone in the hut and walks over to Schultz's cot and lifts the mattress pulling out one of the girly magazines. He quickly thumbs through several pages as Parks enters, drying his hair with a towel and unseen. Check the centerfold, Hazelton, and say a prayer for Milstein. He's at the Pineapple Lounge with the Gamora Brothers. Hazelton quickly stuffs the girly magazine under the mattress and goes to his cot grabbing his Bible. I was just looking for my daily prayer book. Schulze hides everything under there. He may be a thief, Hazelton, but he's not religious. When I was a kid, my father told me, son, go into your closet and whatever you ask the Lord in prayer, believing will be yours. So, one day, he couldn't find me anywhere, but eventually found me sitting in a closet. He asked me, What the hell are you doing in here, son? I said, I want a new bicycle, Dad, but I'm still waiting for him to say yes. God's delays aren't God denials, Chief. Maybe so, Hazelton, but I ended up riding my old bicycle for the next three years until it broke down, and I've never been on a bike ever since. Chief, God works in strange ways, and we still have to have faith. That's for sure, Hazelton. Not long ago, I tried praying again. I figured he owned me one. Did you hear him? No, I'm still waiting for his first word. Our faith is tried in many ways, Chief. You religious guys have an, an excuse for everything, don't you, Hazelton? You let him off the hook too easy, I think. The way I look at it, God should be obligated to us poor sinners when he can do everything. So are the two Belzebub twins seducing Milstein, Chief? Yeah, they're giving him Holy Communion at the Pineapple Lounge. Is that a problem, Hazelton? Well, 
No, but if Milstein's being baptized by those convent sisters of sin, that makes me worry a lot. Do you see what I'm saying, Chief? Hazelton, if Milstein's drinking a little too much gin and rum, is that going to worry you too? Chief, the worst is his being tarnished by the fruits of the flesh. <laughs> What's wrong with the little flesh, Hazelton? <laughs> you have a girlfriend, don't you? No, I have a fiancé, Chief. There's an important difference between the two. You know that. Have you ever done her, Hazelton? If you... If you're saying what I think you said, Chief, of course not. We're not married yet. A woman's body should be held in high reverence before God. Nobody respects a woman's body more than me, Hazelton. What is it with you guys? There's nothing on your minds but dirty sex. Isn't that right? Just because you're a Christian, Hazelton, it doesn't mean we have to forfeit our balls. I've got morals, Chief! Is that why you had your nose stuck in Chelsea's girly mag just a moment ago? I was only observing the filth he reads, Chief, and so I can share the words of truth in the Bible with him. Hazelton, this might make you mad. But do you think you're a righteous pecker before God? Yes, I am, Chief. I'm a righteous... You can't say that word, can you, Hazelton? I can talk to God about tits, asses, and peckers all day. And I know he isn't offended because he's made everything on this earth, and especially you. Busting into the hut is drunken Thomas and Schulze, covered in mud. Thomas is holding a bottle of rum over his head. <laughs> well, if it's in Holy Roller Reverend Hazelton, how do you do? Look at him, Schulze. <laughs> Are we late for confession, Brother Hazelton? Your prodigal sons have returned. Where's Milstein, Schulze? He's right behind his chief with Job's two bosom daughters, little Marie and Lorna. This is against regulations, chief. I'll take care of this, Hazelton. Just read your Bible. But chief, shut up. Shut up, Hazelton. And that's an order. Milstein entered with one pineapple lounge girl wearing a sexy dress and everyone was drunk and covered with mud on their clothes. Hiya, Chief! Meet Lorna! Lorna and I are getting married tonight, Chief! Chelsea, where did you get the mud on your clothes? We were paddling across a draining ditch when Lorna's high hill punctured the raft, Chief. Yeah, 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 the raft started farting and it was all hands overboard for all of us. Why, what the hell is this girl doing here? Are you trying to get us all in the brig, Chelsea? <laughs> and it was my idea, Chief. And will you marry Lorna and me tonight? Chelsea, get that girl off the base. That's an order. Move it. Chief, it it'll break Milstein's heart, and Thomas is the best man for the wedding. I I oh, oh, and by the way, Chief, I saw Leonard walking fast over here. Thomas, get that girl to the latrine. Move it! Milstein, get under the blanket and look like you're asleep. Schultze, get outside and stall Leonard. Move it, guys! Move it! Move it! Move it! What about the mud, Chief? Tell him you fell in the latrine and now get your ass out there and slow him down. Move it! Schultze rushes outside the hut and Thomas pushes the girl into the latrine. In seconds, Schultze is rushing back into the hut. He's coming, Chief! He's coming! He's right, right behind me! Get under your blankets, guys, and don't open your eyes.
They all pulled their blankets over their heads as Ensign Kilroy enters. Chief Parks, it's been reported that a raft is missing from your PBY. The compartment was discovered unlocked. Do you have your keys, Chief? Yes, I do. I need to see them, Chief. Give me a minute. Uh, I left my work pants and keys in the latrine. I'll, I'll be right back. He enters the latrine and Kilroy notices the mud on the floor and curiously sees Thomas vacant caught. Kilroy suspiciously looks around the hut and then Parks enters holding his keys. Here you go. I'll report that you left the compartment unlocked and you're responsible for the missing raft. There's one other matter, Chief. Why is there mud on your floor? I m must have tramped some mud uh, in after taking my shower. Your shoes look clean to me. Oh, I, I was wearing my uh, work shoes at that time. Can I see them, Chief? Uh, you, you want to see my muddy shoes? Yes, that is what I asked. I'll be back in a second. Park enters the latrine and comes back out carrying a pair of muddy shoes. Will these do? They're muddy, Chief, but they look smaller than what you're wearing now. Well, okay. I'm going to pass over this because Lieutenant Simpson wants to see you first thing in the morning about this matter. Good night, Parks. Uh, why is that one cot empty, Chief? Uh, I, I haven't the slightest idea. Maybe Thomas had to take a piss. I, I don't know. I'll inform the shore patrol to look for him. This may lead to the missing raft. Good night, Parks. Kilroy turns to leave when suddenly Thomas enters wearing nothing but a bath towel. Leonard, what brings you to God's little acre? Out for an evening stroll, Thomas? Yeah, I thought I'd flash the shore patrol boys. I'm asking you a straight question, sailor. Well, <laughs> it's embarrassing, sir, but I, I had a wet dream and, and needed a shower. All right, smartass, expect a trip to Lieutenant Simpson's office in the morning. Parks, make sure he gets there. Gilroy exits as the lights slowly dim to black.